Hey, good day again. Right, just get another quick update. I'm just giving you a look at the outfits on. There's something important here that I want to show you. I wasn't able to show you previously because I couldn't actually get the manifold back on until I cleaned those pipes up and got them out of the way. Right. So we'll um, this without actually bolting on. I'm wondering if they won't sit there without. It's going to be difficult. Okay, when they're sitting in their correct spot, okay, roughly about a rule of length. About how they are when they bolt in. Yeah. Because these have got studs in them, you said really just stay there, but it won't. Anyway. Right. Okay. I was hoping to be able to leave the studs near the bolt these manifolds on because yeah, studs are the best idea going into, uh, into alloy. Hopefully this rule is going to stay there when I pull this away. Yeah, good. Okay, that's basically where it sits. Now, when you take it off, okay, see the angle that the mount is, is on? And the studs. So the studs are sort of basically coming up diagonal from the head. So when you take it up from the... and try and pull it up... Trying to sort of do this without up at the point. Okay. That's where it clears the studs. Look at the distance there. That's like three quarters of an inch that it's had to pull out to get off the stud. Just to, not even off the stud yet. Right. Now, what I'm getting at is that if I had made all this, joined it all together, fitted it onto the studs, I wouldn't be able to get it off because it has to be able to come straight up. When it's one piece, it can't, you know, it can't spread out, see? So I'll push it back in, get it back into place. That's where it sits. Pull it out. Right. So, which means that I've got to pull these studs out. I'm going to have to put bolts in them, which as I said I prefer to not have to do, but I don't really have any other option. So, the thing with studs too, especially in the alley, you know, after I take the stud out, I'm going to have to measure how deep that hole is with this, you know, with the manifold and everything in place. And then the bolt that goes in there is going to have to be just like a mill or two short of the depth of the hole. So when it's fully done up, you want it to only be a millimetre off the bottom of the hole. You want to use up all of the thread in the alloy. So, as I said, I prefer to leave studs in there, but yeah, there'd be just no way of getting it on and off. So, I said if it was only a few millimetres, I'd just elongate the holes, but yeah, that's three quarters of an inch. Doesn't look it, but yeah. But when you come up directly vertical from there, that's basically where you're coming up to. Yeah, that's that's the difference between the vertical and the and diagonal. That's all. That was vertical from the head. That that'd be that started be at my fingertip. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Them's the brakes. Just here. Yeah, you got bolts in alloy too. It doesn't help. It helps to not 
take it off too often and hopefully I won't ever have to take it off again once I've done it and rebuilt it. And uh, yeah, anyway, get this back off again. There's a pain to get off. So, get jam in around the wall, just shut out the inside quickly. So, left a good inch or so. And uh, that's for the purpose of being able to put a grommet around around the plug lead. And, uh, yeah, plug now fits in quite neatly. Never fully prepare myself for making videos. There is a thing. Put a plug in one end. He said, you know, with the yeah, I had, when I set them up, I had several layers of aluminium pan. Yeah, wrapped around this bit of pipe so that. It would stay centre on the spark plug. And, uh, and that's not working. It's because that's not. I've actually got it centre. Anyway, yeah. So, probably a little, a little bit tighter than what it could be, but yeah, just got, have to make sure it's all centered when I get those bolts in. The other thing I still haven't done is when I put I've got to put a, a bolt here somewhere to attach the top. I think I might just put a bit of angle and just put a bolt straight up, I think. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Find a bolt. So it's plumb with that and then just put a tab like this on the other cover. So when you push it down, so it just slips straight down over it and uh, put none of it. So, yeah, because so, the other bolt used to go in here in the center. And, yeah, maybe I'll get to it now. The manifold on it, manifold will be long, truly, in a way of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where to put it? Put it up here. Yeah. So I haven't actually rechecked. When I was I first put it together. 
was a little bit tight just in this corner so yeah that should be good it's just clearing it yeah because the other piece slips inside that so yeah we're good because that was actually rubbing on it before it was sort of almost stopping it from bolting down solidly so yeah Okay, so I'll fix that. So I did move it in a little bit more. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye.